Hey everyone, Ed here at Grizzly Taco. It's a beautiful Saturday here in Las Vegas. It's actually nice and somewhat cool, which is unusual. So um, I was out today and I hit a few yard sales and I thought I would share these items with you. I didn't get a whole lot, but I didn't spend a whole lot either, which is cool. So the most expensive thing I spent on today was this. I collect these little jars with the cork caps. Um, I don't know what it is about them, but I have to have them. So I have a whole bunch of them at home, different ones. And this one's uh, the chocolate fun. And they wanted five dollars, and I got it down to two, and uh, I was happy about that because these things run about twenty bucks in the store. I don't know what it is about them, but I just have to have them. I love collecting them. I fill them all with change, and I got them on my headboard. Uh, all the other ones that I have, and they're full of change, like I said. So I was happy to find this. The last time I found one of these at a thrift store, I left it on the back, on the floor in the back, and when I opened the door when we got home, the damn thing rolled out and broke. I was so pissed off. So. The only thing I kept from it was the cork. So if I ever find one that has a without the cork, I have an extra cork at home. So I got that. And usually when I go out to yard sales, I never buy clothes. I'm not really one to want to wear somebody's clothing that you know they wore. But this lady had some brand new shorts, and they were my size, extra large. And these are like the basketball shorts, brand new. And these are I don't know Russell. I don't know if that's a good brand or not. Hang on, where's that? So she had two pairs, this one in blue and another one in black. And she gave me both pairs for a buck. And they're extra large, and that's what I wear. So I, I couldn't pass it up, brand new. So I took those, and then I went to another yard sale. And they had some of these. These um, these are from a casino giveaway. But they're uh, jumper cables. So they gave them to me. Because I bought them both, I got them both for a buck each. So two dollars for those, brand new. Um, I don't need them, but you know what? They're always nice to have. And when my daughters get a car, they're each going to have a set for their car. So I'm going to hang on to those and keep those aside. And here was a cool little find. Uh, I don't need it, but I couldn't pass on it. It's a tripod, and man, this sucker is heavy duty. And I don't know if the legs come down. Oh yeah, I guess they do. They do retract. And it did have the piece on the top where you can screw down your camera and stuff, which is usually what's missing on them. So I bought this thing. I don't know how, how, how tall it's going to get. It says on here, but I can't really read it with my glasses. Pull to... Okay, it just says to pull. It doesn't say how high. But it's a nice little one, and it's in a nice heavy-duty pouch. And I got this for a buck. And that was pretty cool. Didn't spend a whole lot of money today. And the last thing I found was um, there was this area where they have like the, what are those, trailer homes or whatever. And they were doing a, like a little community yard sale in there. So I went in there and the only thing I found was this Uno game. We like to play Uno. So um, I saw it and I, I figured the guy's going to want about three, four, five dollars for it. But I was talking to him about fishing and for about 15, 20 minutes. And when I asked him how much, he goes, you know what, just give me a dollar. So that was pretty cool. And it's brand new in the, in the case, an Uno electronic digital game. So I'm telling you guys, when you go out to these yard sales, if you talk to the people and, you know, just be friendly and stuff, they, I think they give you a lot better deals. So, um, cause I've seen these in the store and they go for about 16 bucks. So I got it for a dollar brand new. So I was very happy with that. So those are, those are the only things that I found at the yard sales. I saw a lot of tools, but it wasn't anything I needed. I mean, there's a lot of drill bits, a lot of different types of drill bits. But again, I've got so many different sets. What do I need those for? I was looking for some channel locks. Um, didn't find any. Um, I almost bought a coping saw, but I've already got two. So I'm like, nah, I really don't need it. So I just left those behind. So that's, that's pretty much it for my yard sale. So let me know what you think. And what did I spend? Two, three, four, five, six seven bucks on all this stuff so that's not a bad deal so you guys enjoy the rest of your saturday uh i'm gonna go over to 7-eleven get me a cold slurpee and then i'm gonna head home so enjoy your guys day bye-bye